Oh boy, this has been an exhausting ride for you if you've been making offers on homes lately. Your competition is multifaceted. You're competing with buyers on a whole different level and a lot of crazy and unheard of before actions are being taken by home buyers in this crazy market. You absolutely want to know about this. So stick with me here to the end of this video, okay? You don't want to miss anything. I'm Steve Popolevsky, a real estate broker with Supreme Home Sales here on Staten Island locally and on this channel. I love helping you guys navigate the home selling process. You're watching this video today because you're tired of making offers on homes and keep losing houses to other buyers, right? Or, or you're thinking about selling your house and you might be worried that by the time you will be ready to sell your house, you might miss on the hot real estate market. In both cases, you have a question that keeps popping into your head and that question is, can home prices keep going up? I'm so happy you're watching this video. Let's get started. Since you've been seriously ready to purchase a home, you've gone through the process of making probably a ton of offers and losing to other buyers who have large down payment than you, for example, or paying as much as over $100,000 over the asking price. And if you buy a house in New Jersey, oh my in addition to these the competition is removing appraisal contingencies and inspection contingencies i can't i can't stand these horrible things to do and if you are selling your house and buying a house at the same time god have mercy housing demand is so high that real estate has become a luxury asset. Can you believe this? The simplicity of the traditional way of buying a house, like just simply qualifying for a mortgage to purchase a house with like a low down payment, for example, and a good credit score and supporting employment verification, rightfully so, is a real challenge. This will take a good amount of time to change, guys. Why? The real estate market, specifically home prices, are driven by nothing more or less than supply and demand. Then you add a very low interest rate to this recipe and you get a hot real estate market. Home inventory shortage has been a problem for quite a good amount of years now and home sellers continue to benefit from the seller's market. Plus, the COVID pandemic has increased buyer demand so much to buy homes while the building of the new homes are taking a lot longer to build them. So it's a race that I think will take a very long time to catch up. Now, as a homeowner, your house is no longer an asset. It is now a luxury asset. No one really knows how long the seller market is going to last, but what I do know is that as long as the demand of home buyers buying homes outnumbers the available homes for sale, home prices will keep going up. Now let's throw in a curveball. Let's look at how will housing interest rates affect the housing market and will raising the interest rates cause home prices to go down? By the way, I did a video about when will housing prices drop. Watch this one next. I believe that once interest rates go up, it will have an impact on the number of buyers competing with you for a house at the same time or competing for your house if you are selling your house maybe less multiple offers and not extensively paying over asking as much 
but I don't believe home prices will go down because of it. I think prices will stabilize a bit and hopefully home buyers will have opportunities without foolishly removing appraisals and inspection contingencies to buy a house. The rule of supply and demand always applies. I do believe though that a serious interest rate spike raised by at least 3% rapidly can cause a dent in the real estate housing prices. People just can't afford it such an increase right now. But the Federal Reserve will have to be really ballsy to do something like that. Absolutely would love to hear from you in the comments below about your opinion and you should watch the next video YouTube recommends for you. Consider subscribing to my channel and remember to click the bell for notification. You don't want to miss videos that I do on a weekly basis. I promise to see you on Monday Thank you so much for watching.